Hello friends, Marcy here. And I have finally received my uh, Pelican uh, pre-order from, it was two months ago, from Endless Pens. Um, I know when I pre-order, they're about a, a six week wait. And I knew it was going to be October before it arrived. And here we are in October. Today's the 26th. Um, I did receive this um, two or three days ago. Um, earlier in the week so um, excited to share with you as you can see it is the Pelican um, Golden Lapis I'm hope I, I hope I'm saying that correctly I already had like ordered months ago I already had the um, ink of the year and I've shared it actually we've swatched it it's in my swatch book it's a gorgeous ink um, and I had it, I actually had it inked in this, um, wonderful, wonderful match. Um, it is, it's been written dry and I have to clean this out. So, um, it is in my cleanup, my Pelican cleanup pile. So here's the ones that are waiting for their bath and re-inking. So, um, joining the Pelican family. Um, I, I really like, I want to share, um, actually, let me get in here uh, while I'm talking. I want to share the, all the Pelican pens. Um, isn't that gorgeous packaging? Wow. Look at the inside. It's like the ink. It's gorgeous blue with that golden shimmer. That's such a gorgeous box. Okay. And our little warranty box, warranty card for you to fill out. Ooh, that's pretty. And it is the M200, which means it has the gold uh, finishes. If it's a, uh, an o ending in 05, it's the silver finish on there. But let's get this out of the plastic. Wow. So Pelican has become my favorite brand um, of pens. And I have all um, 200s or 205s except for uh, the white tortoise. It's a 400, but it's the same size as the 200s. So I love the size and weight and all the, the nibs. Um, they have wonderful nib writing experiences. So um, it's just become my favorite pen. Uh, as you can see, this one is glittery. This is the Moonstone um, Golden Lapis. Let's see. Let me move this aside a minute. These are all the shimmer pens. Um, no, Rose Quartz is not shimmer. Appetite is not shimmer. The Golden Barrel is a shimmer. And then the copper and rose gold has shimmer on the body, but not the cap, which is, it's another pen waiting to be cleaned. So anyway, aren't they, aren't they just such a gorgeous, happy family? And look at how patriotic this looks, <laughs> red, white, and blue. So let's get back to the star of the day, the blue golden. And I will not ink with this bottle because I already have this bottle open and we'll just continue to ink out of that and save this one for later but look at that shimmer it's a gold shimmer but mixed with the blue it tends to have like a, a green shade in the bottle it's all settled on the back because it's been the box has been laying flat so let's put this aside all that gorgeous packaging that I was just so goo goo and gaga over is going away. And we're going to do a rinse, a fill, and a writing sample. By the way, I did get the medium nib on this one. Um, I'm not sure if you know, in a previous video, actually when I ordered the pastel, um, I ordered it, accidentally ordered it with a fine. And I sent it in to Pelican and they did a free nib exchange for me and they put a broad nib on there for me. Um, they do have that program. Uh, you go on their website and within 30 days after ordering a, 
a pin if you would like to have them replace the nib not due to damage but just you know si nib size they do offer that uh, for free um, I just had to pay the shipping to send my pin in and that was it so here we go this one has been sitting this way so there's all of our shimmer I'm gonna let that I'm gonna let that move around or float around while we're doing a quick rinse here on our gorgeous pen and you can it has a transparent I hope you're able to see that the barrel is transparent and you can see the piston um, movement in here so just want to do a quick water flush There we go. And I'll dry that off a little. I don't remember when I ordered the um, ink, but the pen wasn't out yet. And as soon as I saw that it was available, I wanted to add it to my collection. Even though I was not planning on buying it when it came out. It's like, oh, I don't want to buy that because I have enough okay. I don't want to shake it too vigorously and get too many bubbles in there um, which I already have some bubbles but I would like to get some shimmer so get the pen ready I know you're anxiously waiting along with me Oops, I need I do need to shake shake some vigorously. Let's do that again. I'm anxious to see the beauty. And I did get some bubbles. I think I'll let those settle a minute. Okay, let's put some ink in here. So we can start enjoying it. I'm just going to not worry about a full fill right now. Um, looks like I got a pretty good amount in there. At least half. But we can always add more. Let's just get this cap so I don't have an oopsie. And these do post very comfortably. Um, I really enjoy this size and weight of a pen on the M200s of the Pelican. So I write with them posted quite often, but can be unposted. It doesn't really add any back weight. The length is fine with it on or off. And let's talk about today. Saturday. Look at that gorgeous. I think I'll have to get you in closer so you can enjoy some shimmer with me oh these nibs are always so smooth and again this is the medium nib um, click on uh, when I order pens from the same brand um, I try to get a variety of nib sizes. So I have fine, extra fine, uh, medium, broad. Um, I think I probably have about two of each at least. I have to stop talking so I can write. There we go. And the Edelstein ink. some fancy writing gorgeous wow so another beauty um, added to the collection I thank you for spending some of your precious moments with me have a blessed day Bye-bye.